Hello and welcome from the team here at Sign. My name is Crystal and in today's video I will be demonstrating how to set up your dashboard ready for check-in. To get started we are going to organise our visitor type options. From the dashboard head down to the sites tab and click on your site. Scroll down till you reach the visitor type section. By default your visitors are separated into five different visitor types visitor, contractor, staff, courier and student. You can customise your visitor type to suit your needs by clicking on the edit button. From the edit visitor type box you are able to alter your visitor's name as well as their colour designation. Once you have set up your visitor designations to your satisfaction, press save. You can also alter which visitor options are available by simply activating or deactivating their status. The next step is to customise our check-in form. Check-in forms are located on the same page as visitor types under the check-in form tab. After entering the name of the form, you can choose a field type you wish to use. Text, yes, no, multiple choice, and number are all used when you have specific questions your visitor has to answer before entering the site. Signatures are used when confirming that the visitor has read and agreed to your stipulations about site protocol. Fixed text and fixed image are used for important fixed information, such as emergency evacuation areas. NDA is used when it is necessary for the visitor to agree to a non-disclosure agreement. Although SIGN provides a standardised NDA, it can be customised to suit your needs. You can also specify whether the visitor has to respond to each field in order to gain entrance to the site. Lastly, you can alter visibility by visitor type. For the purposes of this demonstration, we have set up a fixed image field, a yes-no field and a signature field for contractors only. Once you have set up your form to suit your needs, press save. You can enable and disable forms at the click of a button. And for previous visitors, you can allow them to pre-fill the form based on their previous responses. In addition to check-in form, you can also set up a check-out form that will automatically pop up when your visitor checks out. This is a great way to set reminders or checklists for your visitors to ensure that they have returned all passes, keys and items they've been given as well as completed all end of day tasks. As with check-in forms, you give the form a title, select the field type needed, fill in your requirements and press save. This form will appear automatically at sign out. One of the options sign provides is the ability to print visitor passes. To set up the pass, you scroll down to the printing section of your site page. You can add custom text to your printed pass, such as your company's name and address. You can also choose to have your logo printed on the pass if you set up your company's logo as seen in our demonstration video 1. Passes can be designated to all visitors or only certain visitor types. They can also be printed automatically or manually. Lastly, you can set up instructions for pass collection, letting the visitor know where they can pick up their pass. Your dashboard is now all set and you are ready to check your visitors in and out. And that's it for our demonstration video too. If you have further questions, check out our help website, help.sign.co, or send a direct message to one of our many staff members that are willing and waiting to help. To see Sign in action, you can check out our 90 second video below. To see more help tutorials, you can click on our playlist link on the right. To sign up with Sign, Click on the sign logo and head straight to our sign website.